What's going on, everybody? It's Bulls Nation Station back at it again with another one. And for today, I want to be talking about this quote that I've read on Zach Levine over the past weekend. You know, um, sources from Chicago personality uh, David Kaplan. He said that um, he's heard that Zach has told people, hey, if they want me here, I'm not going anywhere. You know, I'm building this thing. I'm the first guy in the door, so I want to be part of this. And so, um, you know, just reading that comment, it's not really surprising to us real Bulls fans, the ones that actually pay attention or read between the lines or dig deep because we know we we know Zach Levine wants to be here and it just annoys me every time I see a random quote saying oh well Zach Levine's gonna lead this summer uh, Zach Levine he he he's he's trying to go to the Lakers or um Zach Levine is Boston they're getting ready to um get Zach Levine and Bulls are gonna blow it up and trade him by the uh trading deadline like, all this stuff is just nonsense. I feel like the reporters, they're just, like, either running out of content or trying to create, you know, drama just so they can spread their work. But I don't know why the Bulls is always a fun picking point. Well, I can understand in the previous seasons because we were trash and we had terrible coaches. But this year, nah. You know, I've seen um, I've seen a reporter like Vincent Goodwill. He used to work for the Bulls, but now he works for Yahoo Sports. But he was trying to get Zach Levine to say a controversial comment. And Zach was like, nah, pretty much. He was telling him it's a business. I understand we didn't get the extension, but hey, no drama this way. Then Vincent was like, come on, man, T- tell the truth. Tell me the truth. And so. I look at that type of stuff. It's like, you know, I, know, I understand the reporters have a job to do, but to create, purposely create turmoil for a team is it's, it's kind of messed up because the team should be f- fully focused on trying to win games, keep all the drama out the media so they can just focus on getting better and winning. But these writers like to create these timelines to bring drama to the team, you know, just for their own personal work. And I think that sucks, but in regards to the Zach Levine situation, to all the writers, to all the haters, Zach Levine is not going anywhere. I repeat, he's going to have a way better season this year. And I don't know if you guys looked at his Twitter, but... um. The official Chicago Bulls site They were uh, talking about The White Sox night for the Bulls And they were given like a Example um, custom made White Sox Jersey and Levine He retweeted it he was like yeah we need To get that ASAP pretty much you know So obviously if Zach Levine was Ready to go he wouldn't be worried about all that So Yeah I respect that I mean I'm not sure If Levine actually said This quote It was a report, but either way, I feel like that's how he feels just off the previous um, interviews he's done. And so and and if you pay attention, he constantly said, you know, I want to be here. I would like to stay in Chicago. Like Zach Levine has received nothing but love here, even while the team was losing. So I feel like it's absolutely zero reason for him to want to leave, you know, um, all the moves that the Bulls have made, all the people they brought in, all the trades they sent out, Zach Levine was right there. Like it was almost he he almost gets like the LeBron type of treatment where it's not as big as LeBron because LeBron he could just go to the front office and call the team himself and make a trade. But you know, with the Zach Levine situation, the front office wants to talk with him and make sure you know. He's cool with everything that's going on. So I think that's pretty dope. That's why I have zero worries about Zach Levine leaving. And that's why, you know, the fans should be excited and should be looking forward to things to come in the future because we have a great player on our team. 
You heard the words of Stephen A. Smith when he said he's jealous of the Bulls because he loves Zach Levine. He wished he was on the Knicks, but he's not. So shout out to everybody for listening to this video. Um, subscribe to my page. I'm telling you, I have Bulls content coming out every single day leading up to the season. Like this video, comment how do you feel about that quote. And shout out to the whole Bulls Nation. I'll see you in the next video.